This is smithy.tv. Hi, I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats here at Smithy TV in downtown Toronto with singer-songwriter Dylan Locke. What inspired you to get into the music business? Um, I was kind of just always drawn to it. I didn't really have a choice. Um, I just felt music like anywhere I went really. So um, I was always drawn to the piano, I guess, and uh, eventually singing and guitar and anything I could really express myself in musically. I pretty much just got attracted to so Great. how would you describe your style of music um i guess it's my interpretation or expression of all my inspirations or you know in the past i mean i'm inspired by like queen and all classic rock and stuff so i'd say like a soft rock with a bit of uh like, i don't know kind of a minor sound i guess it's kind of a softer rock kind of thing yeah trying to keep it modern but Awesome. Do what I can, yeah. How does it feel to have your first album coming out soon? It's really refreshing. It's um, I've never it's my I've never experienced it before, so I'm excited to see how many sales I can um, make or how much music I can put out there and get feedback. Um, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. Is sure. there a theme for the album or something that all the songs kind of have in common? Good question. Um. Somewhat. Um, I guess it's all technically kind of a, the songs give off kind of a struggling impression or some sort of pain, but at the same time, um, it's supposed to kind of take that pain away, I guess, because that's what a song does sometimes, mm -hmm. if you sing it or play it or hear it or whatever. So yeah, I guess, I don't know, I guess a few are related about girls. I mean, everybody, every guy writes about girls at some point, so... It's mostly uh, girls, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> and what is your process like? Do you uh, write the music first or the lyrics? How does it work? Good question. Um, usually the, the melody will come first. Like I'll hear like... Dun, 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 and then I'll put in words for that, which is like way harder, I find, because it's got to be the right word for the right melody. Usually it's got to say what, um, you know, the melody speaks. And then, yeah, so I guess melody, then lyrics. And so sometimes I've tried writing lyrics and then uh, putting, like, a melody after. That's what, like, Elton John does, I guess, kind of thing with Bernie Taupman. But um, more so melody and then music, I guess, or lyrics, rather, yeah. Okay. And you grew up in Newmarket, Ontario. Mm -hmm. How did that affect your craft? Um, well, it was interesting because I was in Newmarket from zero to nine i guess ish um like aurora you know york and then from nine to 17 midland victoria harbor which is more north near uh, barry and then um moved out to like 17 so it was really different actually to go from there to there as surprising as it is because they're, they're close but it's really different um everything's kind of a little more laid back and and so i guess it kind of just it made me more laid back and uh, I was more relaxed and I was able to express music better I guess okay. technically yeah and you had a near-death experience you were in a accident when you're riding your bicycle tell me exactly what happened and how that's affected your perspective on life okay well I was biking down a hill from work and I wasn't really paying attention too well at this time and uh, it was actually October 31st last year Halloween and <clears throat> actually last last year right and uh i was biking down and and before i knew it i looked to the right and a truck t-boned me and can ran me right over and i felt it like brush my hair and the wheel went like beside my face and i shot up after the truck passed and i was uh obviously adrenaline rushed to the max um and then ever since then i guess i've been a lot more grateful about everything i kind of slowed down at intersections a lot more and like look at trees and stuff and but I'm more grateful and like everything I do so okay. and has that inspired your music as well yeah I think definitely is it's uh, reflected in my music um, my lyrics sometimes I don't know as much my melodies but my lyrics definitely come out in that way more for okay. sure 
And where is the best place to learn more about you and find out more about your music online? You can Twitter me at Dylan Lockstar. And uh, I'm on Facebook, Dylan Alexander Lock. And YouTube, if you YouTube Lockstar as well. I'm also on YouTube. So. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Dylan. Congratulations. And I look forward to hearing more about your upcoming album. Thank you very Thank much. You. <laughs> I'm Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats here at Smithy TV in downtown Toronto.